Kevin, lu tutup itu. Just arrived on site and we got part of the roof on. Could this be the last piece? Sunday, September 22nd, almost got the roof on, the scene, sending up one of the uh, final panels, we actually uh, had to paint some more, we underestimated what we needed, but uh, this corner is about it, and then the top here, and then uh, if you can see this part, we still have to put that up here as well. I think tomorrow they're going to start on the floor if we can finish the roof. But uh, only one uh, carpenter today. Moving along pretty good. This was our inspiration, this little house kind of where we got the idea. Kind of looks like a pole barn right now. Big pole barn. Again, a uh, 10 by 10 house up here. And then the rest is gonna be a uh, terrace. Eight foot terrace by by 10 and then the 8 feet or 18 by 18 structure. Move them right along. Right doggy? Still got a corner up there. Time is 5 o'clock, September 22nd, Sunday, and we got the roof on, for the most part. Still have to do this top part, but everything is coming together here. But check this out. Sun's going down, sunset. Imagine that once this is all complete. So, Sunday, September 22nd, roof is on. Tomorrow they're gonna finish it up. Um, they still have to finish up this part. 
up here. So, and then uh, they'll start on the floors tomorrow. So, moving right along, it is uh, what two, four, six, I think it's the seventh day of construction. Remember, we're only working two days a week. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hey everybody, it's October 5th and it's Saturday and we're back out here at the beach house and I kind of wanted to give you a quick update. So let's take a look. So right off the bat, we see a new fence here. My brother-in-law Mario put this together. It took him about four days and uh, he said this is kind of unusual for the other homes in the area so we are the pioneers of this of this type of fence and what you can see here is that he notched out and slid this uh, quarter piece of bamboo through each each slat and I got a mad dog here because I'm by the puppies but uh, let me get by this, one sec. Here's the ocean. So this place was our inspiration. See how it's open on the bottom and then they got a little top up here and then this is our place here. So Some people have been asking why, are your, why is your house on stilts? Well, a lot of houses are not on stilts. We saw this, and this is kind of what we were thinking we were building, but we're building this massive. So let's keep looking at the fence here. Got another puppy in the way. Hopefully the mommy won't get mad at me and attack me. But again, notched out each big piece of bamboo. Very sturdy fence. And if we look at other fences, basically we're just tied together at each, each point. So, very nice job on the fence. As you can see, we have one opening here. And another opening right here. We need to buy some hinges and we're gonna put a two by three, I guess inside, uh, inside the bamboo. So we can put hinges on and locks. So we can lock this place down. This is the inside, and as you can see, these are all bamboo pieces. I uh, think if I can find a video, I kind of help prepare some of these boards. quarter pieces and then you got the solid ones there's our other opening so we can look at the ocean from our place we got one tree notched out coconut This is actually Mary Lou's brother's coconut, so I said we'll take good care of it. I want to plant a 
maybe a banana tree and some other fruit trees. There's Mary Lou. She's uh, taking a look. Yeah, happy camper, she says. We'll go take a look upstairs. Check this out. But we do have the floors almost done on the bottom. This place down here is going to be kind of a hangout area, so not everybody is upstairs. Right over here, this spot, which is right uh, below the house, we want to put a, uh, like a, a cemented storage area. And then over here is our dirty kitchen. We'll have a kitchen over here. And a CR over here somewhere. A CR restroom is a CR comfort room is what they call them here in the Philippines. Restroom in the United States. So for now, we're just peeing in the bucket. But let's take a look upstairs. Right here is going to be the access for the stairs to come down. And uh, I think they're going to, they might be working on that uh, this weekend, but we want to complete the fence because we just don't want people coming in, going up here, so. My brother Mario, he's a genius and uh, built this bamboo ladder. So let's head up, check it out. Alright, got the floors. <laughs> That's my Ate. Ate, Ate. And uh, Mary Lou. That's gonna be the view. The view. <laughs> That's gonna be the view. We're getting, uh, we're gonna cut this tree right out here. We're gonna half it. So we'll, we'll have more of a view. This tree right here, I wanna kind of keep for the shade just as long as it doesn't get any taller. This is the uh, stairs entrance right here. And there's going to be a railing around here for the kids. And then a railing over here. Three-point contact, three-point contact, never, always have three points. One hand, two feet, two hands, one foot. Good job, good job. <laughs> 